Before we start today's video, I just wanted to let you guys know that I have merch on sale on my store. If you guys want to get to my merch, hit my about page on my YouTube channel. And also, YouTube tells me that most of you guys aren't subscribed, so if you aren't, please hit that subscribe button. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. Hello everybody, Lord Valoran here. Welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And in today's episode we are going to go to Kakariko Village is, is what it's called. Uh, that The king told us to go to Kakariko Village to get more info. And uh, about how to defeat Ganon. In the last episode, we got a new area of the map called the Dueling Peaks area. Explored a little bit and we found some shrines. And we found the stable. And behind the stable, we found our very first horse. For right now, his name is Will. But later on, in the and but later on, we're gonna in this episode, I'm gonna choose whoever has the best name for Will, and then we're gonna name him Will. So there's a little bit of a there's a little bit of a <laughs> there's a little bit of a community making in, in this video, I guess, as you guys can say, as you guys can Im make an impact on the series. Now let's read this sign. Oh, okay, so Kakariko Village this way and had to know Village is that way. We need to go to Kakariko Village, so Kakariko Village is this way. What the fuck are you? Oh my god, he scared me. Shakala, you! You can see me? I can see you. Shalaza, Shalaka! What the fuck? It's been a hundred years since anyone has been able to see me. I'm Hestu and I need your help. Those, those monsters over there stole my m beloved maracas. Monsters? Oh, I think they're still on the other side of those rocks. I can't use my powers without them, Soko. So please, please get my maracas back from them. Sure, Hestu, I got you. Holy f What? Bitch. Bro, what? Bro, leave my horse alone, bro! No! <laughs> mm, there's no. Bro, what? Bye. How did you even hit me? No, I'm not dying. I'm not dying. Bro, I need easy access! I don't want this big ass. You know what? I'm throwing it out. Some oh my god! Oh my god! Mm. How did that hit me? <laughs> How did that hit me? Ooh. Bro, I need easy access weapons. Oh, he fell off the fucking mountain. No, I'm not dealing with that. Bro, what? And blows him off. Are you kidding me? Oh, he died, bro. No, I'm not dying to you. No, I'm not dying to you. I'm not dying to you. Bro, Link. That was supposed to happen when I shot him in the eyeball last time. Dun, 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 dun. What the hell? He was shaking him since he was two years old. Okay. We finally killed them all. Estu, Shakala, those are those are my maracas. Please give them to me. Um, here. 
Shalaka! But wait, there's something wrong with my maracas. The Korok seeds inside are gone. How am I supposed to dance now? If I just had one Korok seed, I could sing, dance, and use my powers to help you. You see, I have the power of inventory expansion. So let me know if you find some Korok seeds. Oh, oh I have some. Eh. I have like three, I think. I don't remember. Alright, let's head on to the village this time! Or Link! Break this. Shrine nearby, how? Oh, I think this is the village! I think this is Kakariko Village, guys! Yes! Oh, there's arrows stuck up there for some dumb reason. Just jumped over something. Kakariko Village! Uh, finally! We've made it to Kakariko Village! Ouch! Oh no, what's the matter? Are you okay? Traveler, I'm sorry, but I've seemed to have twisted my ankle, Nana! Hmm, let's see here. No, don't stand! I'm sorry you had to see me like that. Uh, just say, Traveler. Where did you get that object hanging from your wrist? Well, you see, blah, 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 and blah, 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 blah. Oh. Yes, I see. That Sheikah Slate is a symbol. It means that you're a hero of legend. Though there are few who know such of the legends anymore. But we Sheikah have been waiting for a very, waiting for you for a very long time. Please, before all this, I must insist that you meet with our Lady Impa. Where is she? Oh, that ginormous house. Lady Impa's house is below Lantern Falls, just over there. Okay. In any case, it was a real honor to meet you. <laughs> I suppose you're used to that, having lived as long as you have. Yeah. Thanks, Nana. I hope you feel better. There's a chicken right there. <laughs> I want some clothes. <laughs> our clothes, our our clothes are the tops. That makes perfect sense. Uh, let's see what you have. Ooh. Oh, let's have a coronavirus mask. Did she just cuz? I'll take that. How much for this? 90? Alright. I think I have some. What? Here, can, can I sell you some stuff? I want to sell. Um, I know I have some more of these. Let's just, let's, just, let's just get back up to 500 rupees so I can buy the coronavirus mask. Bro. Yes, I want to sell, bitch. Stop talking to me. God damn. Bitch, just talk too much, y'all. <laughs> like, what the fuck, bro? I don't care, my nigga. <laughs> 48 rupees. 500? Uh, close enough. I don't need keys. Uh, bat wings. 500 rupees. All right. No, bye. God damn. Stealth mask. 500 rupees. Yes. Give me the mask. Alright, thank you. Now let's put on our brand new clothes. Yes, sir. Wait, I don't know. Maybe this matches better? Yes! Link! He has better... Wait, no. Let's... Eh, I'll, I'll stick with it. Alright, let's head on over. <laughs> to... This house, well, it looks like it's kind of guarded real quick. Hold on. Whoa, huh? What the hell? What the fuck? You there, who are you? How dare you trespass on Lady Impa's abode? Hmm? Is that a Sheikah Slate? But would that mean you're. No, it's not possible. Can it be? Bro, what the oh. fuck? Please forgive us for behaving so rudely. Of course, we have heard the legends of Lady from Lady Emperor herself. Please, friend, go ahead and step inside. Okay, thank you, fucking losers. Huh? A man? <laughs> Is that? It's. It's a Sheikah Slate. Could it you be the hero my grandmother told me about? Uh, what was his name? L Lin? Um. No, not that I forgot. I'm just bad with speaking. As for me, my name is P P P Pai. 
Oh, my name is Pie. She's so fucking weird. Phew, I got it out. I know I should be able to say that easily, seeing I'm that was my own name and all. I am so sorry. Oh my God, bro, this is cringe. Anyway, my mother's been awaiting your return ever since I was little. Please hurry inside. God damn, so are you really a hundred years old? Impa, I'm here. No. So, you're finally awake. Yes. Hello, Impa. It has been quite a long time, Link. <laughs> I am much older now. Hmm. But you remember me, don't you? No, I do not remember you. <laughs> What's the matter? You're looking as, at me as <laughs> though I'm a stranger to you. Those eyes, they lack the light of familiarity. Familiarity. F familiarity. I don't know how to say that word. <laughs> it is I, courageous one. Impa. Surely you must at least remember the name Impa. I see. So you have lost your memory. Well, it matters not. In fact, that may be a blessing in disguise for the time being. Dearest Link, please come a bit closer. Closer. Please come a bit closer. <clears throat> a hundred years ago. Yes, a hundred years ago, the kingdom of Hyrule was destroyed. After you fell, Princess Zelda's wish. Well, after you fell, Princess Zelda's final wish was to place you in a sink in a sacred chamber. Slumber. I think that's what she said. <laughs> and then all alone, alone she went to face Ganon. Before Princess Zelda, before Princess Zelda went to nobly meet her fate, she entrusted me with some words she wished to say to you. I've been waiting a hundred years to deliver the princess's message. The princess's message. However, these words, which the princess wished her life to leave you, well, if you are, well, if you are to hear them, you must be prepared to risk your life as well. I'm afraid that my that burden. <laughs> I'm afraid. But I'm afraid that burden may be too much to bear while you are still without your memories. I'll leave the choice to you. When you feel you're ready to receive the princess's message, return to me. Uh, okay. The words that the pris the words that the princess risked her life to impart you. I cannot pass them on to someone who lacks conviction. Are you prepared to risk your life for the greater good? <laughs> ha! Not a memory to your name, yet you are intent to to charge forward with only courage and justice on your side. You have not changed a bit. Once a hero, always a hero. Yes, sir. Oh. Very well. Since you have lost your memory, I will recount for you all that has happened. The history of the royal family of Hyrule is also the history of Calamity Ganon. A primal evil that has endured over the ages. This evil has been turned back time and time again by a warrior wielding the soul of a hero and a princess who carries the blood of the goddess. With the passage of time, each conflict with Ganon faded into legend. Yeah. So listen closely as I tell you of this legend that occurred 10,000 years ago. Hyrule was then blossoming as a highly advanced civilization. Yeah. Even the most powerful monsters posed little threat to the denizens of the realm. The people thought it wise to utilize their technological prowess to ensure the safety of the land mm. should Calamity Ganon ever return. Right, right, right. Towers, the Divine Beast, I believe. They constructed four mechanical wonders that came to be known as the Divine Beasts. They also built a legion of autonomous weapons 
called God. Oh, the guardians. <laughs> the divine beasts were piloted by four individuals of exceptional skill from across the land. And thus, the plan to neutralize Ganon was forged. Hmm. Okay. Then he came. Upon Ganon's inevitable return to Hyrule, mm -hmm. the princess and the hero fought alongside these four champions against this ancient evil. The Guardians were tasked with protecting the hero as the Divine Beasts unleashed a furious attack upon their terrible foe. Mm. And when the hero wielding the sword that seals the darkness delivered his final blow, the princess used her sacred power to seal away Calamity Ganon. Mm. Ganon! We're coming to get you, Ganon. Yeah. A hundred years ago. In preparation of the foretold revival of Ganon, we strove to follow the lead of their ancestors 10,000 years prior. Aww. But in the end, despite our best efforts and careful planning, we underestimated his power. In order to avoid making, ever making that grave mistake again, the princess left you these words. Oh. Free the four divine beasts. That's what she said. Four divine beasts. The four divine beasts are these ancient Sheikah weapons wielded by the four champions who Ganon defeated. The divine beast Varudanya, controlled by Daruk of the Gorons. The divine beast Vameto, controlled by Rivali of the Rito. And the divine beast Varuta, controlled by Mipha of the Zora. And the divine beast Vanaboris, controlled by Urbosa of the Gerudo. It would be extremely ill-advised to face Ganon without the power of the Divine Beasts to help you. You must infiltrate the Divine Beasts that were stolen away by Ganon 100 years ago and bring them back to our side. More information about these Divine Beasts can be found by locating the four races scattered across Hyrule. Oh. Okay. The Sheikah Slate will guide you on your way. You must go where it tells you. Go where it tells you and meet with each leader there. Okay. Okay. Free the Divine Beast. New objective. And it seems to me that your secret slate is not yet complete. The Device Princess Zelda left you as your guide and also your memory. Now let's see. Someone at the research lab in Hetano Village might be able to help you. Hetano Village? Is this area? Okay. Huge area! The location shining on the eastern edge of is Hetano Village. It is a small village, one of the very few places of your avoided suffering significant damage during the Great Calamity. Locked memories. No objective. You are Princess Zelda's only hope, and Hyrule's as well. You cannot turn back now. Follow your heart and seize your destiny. Seek out Impul Complete! And that is the final... Oh, hello, Peyo. And that is the final... Mission, I guess. <laughs> I'm joking. That's not the final mission. This is, and there we go. We finally, met, hey, finally met Impa, and uh, yeah, she gave us fun. Oh my God, guys, I feel so. Oh man, I feel so happy. Is my horse still down here? Yeah, he is. But yeah, okay. Um, yeah. Um, let's get started. There's supposed to be a shrine around here somewhere. I don't see it at all. I don't know. I don't know where it. Oh, oh. It's right there. Um, okay. Well, we have a lot to do next episode. A lot to do. Today's video was very, very long. Um, all right. So we have a lot of inventory stuff or extra memories besides destroy Ganon. But we can't do that one yet. Well, we can, but we just can't do it yet because I don't want to die instantly and embarrass myself. Um, we have free the divine beast and locked mementos. I don't think we're going to free the divine beast right now because there's literally 
they're literally scattered across the land, so we're not going to do that one. We're going to do the locked memories next, and then probably in the next episode we're going to do that shrine and uh, explore a little bit more of the village and get our money back up because I'm broke apparently. And yeah, we're we're just going to do some more, you know, open world stuff, you know, open world stuff. <laughs> but yeah, uh, maybe get some like, some better clothes. You feel me? And yeah, um, yeah, we're going to do all that in the next episode. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate you guys' comments, and I really, I, mean, I really appreciate you guys' support on the videos recently. I've been making a lot of them for the past couple of days slash weeks. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Uh, let's get on with this series. Oh my god, we have a lot to do before we beat the game. And we're barely even at we're barely even at the beginning. This is crazy. <laughs> but yeah, uh, thank you guys for tuning in for today's video. Make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe. I love you guys to death, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.